Hey guys, I've been looking for some new denim shorts for this summer, but I don't seem to find any that I like out in the shops. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I cut my own shorts out from an old pair of jeans. So if you're interested in how I do it, please keep on watching. For this project, you will need an old pair of denim jeans, a pair of scissors, and a marking pen. Optional, a ruler, a shallow bucket, some bleach, and a sewing machine. First of all, you will need to put on your chosen pair of old jeans. From the size seam, mark down the length that you would like for your new shorts. For me, my marking is around 8 inches down from my waist. And then take off the jeans. Lay it flat on the floor or any surface, fold it in half, make sure that the crotch area is in place. And then copy the marking that we marked earlier to the other tube of the jeans leg, just like so. And then do the same on the front and the back so it is clearer when we start cutting. The next step is to use the ruler to mark down how long you want the inner seam area to be. I don't want it to be too short, so I make a slant line of about 3 inches down from the crotch. Do the same on the other side so it would be even for both legs. And then connect the two markings that we did on the outer side seam and the inner side seam together. And also, don't forget to do the same on the other leg. Now here comes the exciting part, which is to cut the chips of the jeans off. A lot of people would just cut the front and the back at the same time, but I think it will make the shorts lose its shape. So here I'm just cutting the front fabric, it doesn't matter if you can't make a clean cut here because we're gonna fix it later. After that, I'm finally cutting the fabric at the back. But instead of cutting a straight line, I'm making a curved line, almost like a semi-oval shape, so the back is a bit longer than the front. The purpose of it is to create a smoother line and to cover the butt cheeks. Some people wouldn't mind, but I don't want mine to hang around while I walk. It's a bit too sexy for me. Just cut it carefully, but it doesn't have to be perfect. And then you can just trim the cutting so the front and the back lines connect smoothly together. Just like so. Do the same on the other side and this is what the shots look like and you could just simply stop here if you like but I'm adding some more details to my shots so here I'm using my sewing machine and sew around the chips where we just cut earlier about 1cm away from the edge um, This is to keep the denim fabric from fraying And this is what it looks like after sewing Next, pour one pot of bleach and one pot of water into a shallow bucket. Um, because I want my shorts to have a deep dye look, so I'm dunking only half of my shorts into the bleach mixture. And since the mixture is pretty concentrate, I just keep dipping it in for like around 30 to 60 seconds and then just leave it out. This is what it looks like putting the shots under the sun for about a minute. Five minutes later, you can see the bleach is doing its job pretty well. And this is what it looks like 10 minutes later and I like the colour already. So I'm taking the shorts back to my bathroom and rinse the remaining bleach off or else it will keep reacting on the fabric. I noticed that the black thread that I sewed around the edges earlier didn't bleach out at all. So if you don't want the thread to show, 
please use a cotton thread or like to call a synthetic thread instead. And then just simply throw the shorts into your washing machine and clean it thoroughly. After washing and drying, as you can see the edge has frayed a bit. It would be more obvious and messy looking after a few more washes. But if you don't want to wait just like me, I'm trying to use my fingers to loosen the fabric out. Just keep pulling and pulling. You will start to see some threads coming out. And you can also use some tool to help with the fraying process. I'm using a brow brush which comes with a metal tip mascara one thingy and I'm just brushing it through the fabric so it frays much easier. And as you can see here, the black thread that I sewed on earlier creates a barrier to stop the fabric from fraying all the way up. And this is what it looks like after a few minutes of torturing. <laughs> And if you like, you could distress your shots a bit more by cutting two lines on where you want the patch to be and then using your fingers or clippers to pull out some blue threads in between the two cuts, leaving only the white horizontal thread. And so this is what my final product looks like. I didn't distress the front area because I like the look of how the bleach and the creases turn out. Um, the sides of the shorts are a bit shorter than the rest and so it gives a really nice curve. And the back. A lot of times you find denim shorts that are selling in the shops are a bit too short, so cutting your own shorts can fit your desired length and other details perfectly. So thank you so much for watching, if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos. I'll see you guys next time, bye bye!